Are we Inside. On? I think we're on. Are we in? It turns out Carl Moss Media can lift. Are we in? We're on. I don't. We're all doing this. We're in. I don't think so, we're all in. We're all can't see. Just a way to start. To Today, Carl, aka Carl Moss Media, is now lifting coach. Extraordinaire. Extraordinaire. So Carlos is going to take us through some Olympic lifting because we're all really poor at it. I'm sick. We're all very stiff. So Carl is going to take us through some good mobility drills and then some basics on the Olympic lifting. Carl is not on that side of the camera, it's on this side of the camera today. So we're going to do the filming. <laughs> Are we live? We're live. Right guys, we're live. So today we're going to take the lads at the strength factory through some Olympic lifting drills. Uh, they want to get into it just because they're going over to the hybrid side of things from the powerlifting and stuff. So we know they've all got the strength to do it. It's just a case of uh, the drills to do it, um, learning bar paths, uh, learning mobility, and trying to find the start point basically of weightlifting and basically just learning the fundamentals of doing so. So if you're going to come into gym to Olympic weightlifting session, me personally, I'll just jump on the assault bike for five minutes at a steady pace just to loosen off, just like any other thing. You don't have to go through anything special. Uh, so I have a demo in case you don't understand what that means. Zach's going to give you a demo of going full send on the. Uh, send it, Zach. What level are we going? Uh, send it. Erg 5 or Erg 10? Yeah, we're going, the we're going 10 out of 10 levels. What's that doing? Mine's really low levels, so it's alright. It's, it's, all, it's all relative to that. Seat to right. Seat to right. It's like CEO lifting, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 1,000 watts, 500 watts. Fuck it! Yeah, yes! 2,000 yeah. off the scale, it said. <laughs> Zach's foot now. Yeah, so basically, before you start, it's going to go through some mobility drills. If you've never lifted before, you're basically going to find out whether you're in a good position to lift. Which is because probably going to be a lot, a lot of people won't be, and they will be anywhere. And we'll show you some common kind of faults that people do. So first of all, as Danny was doing before, shoulder dislocates. If you can't do one of them by keeping your arms straight, you shouldn't be like bending like this, you know what I mean? So your arms should be straight, over, touch the back. Everyone can do that, can not they? You can, you can, you're all right, aren't you? Yeah, some people can't do it, so. That, that's the start, I'm just loosen off the shoulder joints. And How then, many would you do? I just do like two sets of ten or something like that. I don't go mad, but my, my mobility is quite good. So depending on your level, if you've got feel like you've got bad mobility and bad movement, then I would say do more before you actually start, you know what I mean? To properly loosen Question up. is right now, with hips, camera skills, do you feel like you're on ship or not? I'm <laughs> fucking buzzing with this. Have you got sea sickness yet? Andy Gimple. He's actually on a, he's on a, he's on a Mazda. Oh, he's on a Mazda, isn't it? He's on a Mazda. Right, so today, we're, gonna, we're not going to go through snacks. We're going to go through power clean today. What I think is the most basic movement that don't require as much coordination as the other ones, like squat clean, like snaps, like power snaps. I don't feel like it needs as much coordination. So, first of all, Joe, we're going to find out if you're in a position to even power clean to a start. But some people want to come in and lift, and they literally won't be in a position to. First one is, can you get the bar in a front rack, resting on your shoulders? Not everyone will be able to get to this position. If you can't get to the position, but you can get to there, that's good enough. Because as soon as the weights are on, yep. it'll be there. So, so someone new now, where would you put your hands on the bar? Yeah, so first of all, if you're learning where to put your hands on the bar, as you're stood up straight, the bar should be meeting your upper thigh on the clean. So that there is on my upper thigh, so I know that there, about shoulder width. Just below ball height. Yeah, but that's with my arm length. If you've got a longer arm length, what you might have seen in Olympic weightlifters is they have an actual, they have a wider grip. That's because it just gives them more room to turn over there. If you are too narrow, then you ain't getting your elbows through there. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. So that's to start with. So first of all, get a bar in a, find your, find your clean position. So that should be on your upper thigh. And then, you can see if you can get in that front grab position. Yeah, once you're in that front rack position, all you're going to do is rotate your right arm forward and then left. And then rotate that and do that about 10 times. Yeah. From the, once you've done it 10 times, bar on the back of your neck, 
And what I like to do here, not everyone likes to do these drills, these are mine, these are personal preference drills. In my opinion, these are the best drills for me. Before anyone starts striking at me. Right. Yeah? I just rest on the back and I just let it pull my arms back and let it bring my wrist behind. Like that, yeah. You're fine. I'm fine, yeah. mate. Just let it I'm fine, right, so now we're just going to go for a simple power clean bar pack warm up. So starting down with the mid chin, first of all we're going to do five clean deadlifts. So start with the mid chin, keep the back close to the body, up to the hip. We'll do that five times. Yeah, then we're going to go into a clean pull. With a clean pull, we're going to perform a clean deadlift that's set from at the top. It's going to come into contact with the upper thigh, and we're going to do a little shrug upwards, yeah? So five of those. Yeah, that's it. Coming up onto the toes at the top of the clean pull. Yeah. And then we're going to go into five muscle cleans. So back into mid chin, clean deadlift into pull, and bringing the bar up to the shoulder. Bar pass stays the same on the way down as it does on the way up. Back down the body. Up. Clean pull. Yeah, after that we're going to do five power cleans. So the only difference between the power clean and the muscle clean effectively is it's going to be contact at the hip. So from the hip we're just going to give it basically a little tap whilst pulling the bar upwards, trying to keep the bar as close as we can to the body. So we're down and up. Just a tiny little tap off the upper thigh. Yeah, as you wait, what you need to remember when it's just barbell is we need to keep the, we're not looking for that explosiveness. Because if we do do that explosiveness, it's going to take the bar away from you. And we're going to do that. Yeah, as the weight builds, we'll then build that explosiveness. Always going through the full range of motion first. So if we've got tens on, it'll be the same. As the weight builds, that, that power will just get more. Yeah. Yeah. So I think we'll just start building. And then we'll just do some lifts for banter. Yeah, and snap once it's hat to hit. Yeah, go slow, 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 slow. Yeah. Bimble power. If that, help, if that helps you get it past the knee, then go slow. Go slow until you pass the knee. I don't like that, but so I know it does help you bring it on. Just until you pass the knee. Until you're there. Not that slow, but as soon as you get near that hit, then you start to pass the knee. Right. I don't feel like I'm driving that much off my hips either. No, well you shouldn't get this I way. I can't come it up. If you do too much power here, and it's live, why it's fuck here, it's going to make you fuck there. Try and think about more going through the full range of motion first, rather than being yeah. explosive. Because yeah. naturally, when it gets heavier, the explosion will come because you think, fucking this is getting heavy now. And naturally, you ease yourself into it. Like when you're on a deadlift, a bit like, you just go through it, whatever. And when it gets heavy, you know, right, I need to explore it. Yeah. More so. Right. I know you'd practice that from the start, you practice that from the start, but you know the difference when it's from the right, right. So it's getting heavy. I think mean, it's because you know you can mong it to your top. Yeah, yeah. definitely. Isn't it? 100%. On it. I just gotta get lost on it. I'm just tryna break loose. I'm about to light the fuse. I just need me a cup. I'ma pour me the juice. I got the juice now. I got the juice now. I got the juice now. I got the juice. Uh. 
I got the juice now. I got the juice now. I got the juice now. I got the juice. Hello. Ladies and gentlemen, I welcome it. Let me take a moment and introduce you to some better men. A better man like Letterman, but still next way. Never see me off air, cause you know my best days are ahead of me. The editing and pedigree is all in one. Rip every single head off, but it's all in front. The competition don't exist, we don't follow them. They follow us, hoping to get a glance of a better me. See, I got the juice, I got the crackers, I got the wine, but they got it backwards. Whoever thought that religion could be this good, but don't turn all of us rappers to pass us. Communion to union of dopeness is plastered all over the wall, and they ain't even ask us. My God is the Father, you know we came after the gangsters, the orphans. And all of us bastards Adopted and not some options Have been presented to me I'm like an automatic weapon On a mercenary They just wanna see the blood They don't wanna see the heavy heart Attached to it all Even though I'm good and ready Able to deliver Whatever the situation is calling for I'm capable of more than playing roles Awkward Then it's our turn to do the opposite Now it's very obvious We go to own I just gotta go